Welcome back to the Honeywell Cook-Off Show, guys. I'm your host, Toby Bakri. Last time you were here, the contestants made the Honeywell pasta, the spaghetti and the macaroni. They did quite well, but the judges felt they could do quite a bit more. So today, we are one step away from crowning our Honeywell chef. They'll be making Honeywell bowl food, We'll be making the Honeywell semolina and the Honeywell wheat meal. How well will they do? Just one choice of soup to be made. All contestants still have an equal chance of winning and we'll be looking out for who is going to impress us with their meal today. Juliet, what's the inspiration behind the meal the last time? I mean, you blew everybody's mind away. Iron Chef program and Chopped. Oh, okay. So you've been watching a lot of TV. All right, that's interesting. So, Chica, have anything for us? What soup will you be making? Um, that's left for you to find out. Oh, okay. Okay, guys, same rule applies. I'm going to give you exactly 1 minute and 30 seconds to get your items from the pantry, after which you're going to have exactly one hour to make a soup and the Honeywell wheat meal and the Honeywell semolina. In one hour, you should be done cleaning your work environment and food should be plated and ready for the judges. Is that okay? Yes. Okay. Your 1 minute 30 seconds starts right away. In three, two, please stop, stop, stop to your stations, guys. Leave that, back to your stations. Do we have all we need? No response, you don't? Well, I'm sorry, you have to make do with what you have. Guys, I'm gonna give you exactly one hour to make your meals. Remember, you have to make the Honeywell wheat meal and the Honeywell semolina with a choice of soup. Are we good to go? Yes. Your time starts in three, two, one, guys. Let's go, let's do this. Five, four, three, two, and guys, stop, stop. No movement, please. Just stand behind your dishes. Super proud of you guys. Looks like you put your dish together in the exact time frame. Who's most confident to show off their dish to the judges first? I want to see him first. Classic? Yeah. Are you confident, my man? No so, lumps. Mm -mm. No lumps, nothing. Texture is good. Texture is good. And it doesn't taste sweet. <clears throat> yeah. It doesn't taste sweet. Oh, yeah. Which There's a hack. Properly, properly if your made, semolina, yeah. semolina tastes sweet, tastes... then it's not properly cooked. Oh, okay. So it's properly wow, cooked. Wow, I'm hearing that for the first time. Like you didn't cook it enough. Okay. Chef Elizabeth. Yes, is fine. You should have cooked your wheat a little bit longer. It's smooth, but you should have cooked it a little bit longer. You guys haven't quite talked it's about smooth. the flavor of the dick icon. We can't even get into it. Okay, so the plating, there's a problem with the plating. Yeah. It's, I mean, it's pretty, yeah. but, but it's, how it's not accessible. Yeah. Chica, can you please bring up your plate? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, mm. It is good. It is really good. Mm -hmm. Judges look impressed. It is really good. I'm going I'm, I'm to go. And Chica is all smart. All right, now we're going to move on to the next. Thank you very much, Chica. Thank you very much. Thank you. Looks like you have impressed the judges with your meal. All right, Julia, let's have your dish. I like her choice of soup. It was bold. Okay. My choice of soup is bold. For me, it's an acquired taste because um, bitter leaf, which I'm not very used to. Okay. But the other elements of the dish are fine. Her proteins are cooked through. You know, it's an even portion okay. of like sauce. So someone and who loves meat. bitter leaf soup would love this. Yeah. Yes. And I like how she didn't crowd her bowl with okay. too much protein. So it was easy for us to yeah, access. So it's not like you're overshadowing yeah. Yeah. Right. everything. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Now that's the last dish from this phase the judges will be tasting. We're going to leave them now to score the contestants. Good luck to them. They all look like they did quite a good job. I wish them well and nothing but luck. 
scores are in, guys. It's time for the contestants to find out what all that hard work earned them on this phase of the competition. First up, we have Chica with a total score of 16. How do you feel about that, Chica? It's fair, but you expected more. Juliet, 15. Elizabeth. Lastly, we have Chef Classic, 23. He aced that. How are you feeling right now, brother? Feel good. Juliet won the last round, Classic won this round. We'll be watching out for who's going to win the last round, and then we'll get to total their scores and find out who our winner is going to be. Up to half a million up for grabs and a year's supply of Honeywell products. I'm definitely going to be getting close to the winner as I need some of that cash prize and the Honeywell products. Don't judge me.